Steambirds Alliance is a it's a bit of a departure from the Steambirds series, which was a turn-based tactical um, plane sh game. Uh, Steambirds Alliance is an action game, and it's um, a massively multiplayer co-op online bullet hell shooter. So, uh, which takes place in a procedurally generated world. What we're trying to do is we're trying to minimize the amount of friction that there is in getting into the game and meeting up with your friends and beating some badass bosses. So you'll be able to just drop right in, no lobby system, nothing. You can just meet up with whoever you know, meet up with some strangers for an ad hoc group, and um, collect some sweet loot as you defeat a, uh, an amazing boss. We started using PlayFab about six months ago, I want to say. And it was just at the time when we started implementing our online saving system. So we were considering implementing our own, but um, PlayFab came around and offered us essentially an API that did exactly what we wanted and um, allowed us to just skip that whole like setting up server phase, skipped uh, all sorts of busy work that we would have had to do. And so we've been, we initially used it for the, the players save data. And now we're also using it for um, in-game chat. And we have plans to use even more PlayFab features as time goes on. We chose PlayFab essentially out of trust. Um, we, we know James Gortzman, the CEO, from, uh, from the past. And we know that he's a, uh, not going to sell us on something that is not actually good. And um, throughout the process, we've had contact with the developer relations team that has been excellent. Um, they've been responsive to our questions. We've had features that we've wanted to implement that they've gone ahead and built for us. And in general, it's been a very positive experience. You know, you don't you don't just jump into this thing and just like plug it in, right? You have to write build your whole whole game around it. So it's been a very gradual process, and and every step of the way, it's been positive. The most important PlayFab features will depend a lot on what game you're making. I think that a lot of people will be interested in the free built-in analytics. Um, I think that a lot of people would be interested in in some of the um, server management things. I know that we're actually fairly interested in the support and user management features, because that's something that we always do. <laughs> Whenever we do an online game, we always have, we always struggle with that. It's always hard to deal with customers who are like, oh, I lost this item, or, you know, this glitch happened in the game, and, and I got like 10 items that I don't need, and I can't log in anymore, and you can just fix that with the web interface. And so that's what we're looking forward to.